All right, it's that time of the year again. I'm Johnny P, and we're here live at the Chiller Expo for Halloween 2010. And I'm honored to sit next to one of Goodfellas stars who played young Henry Hill. We got Christopher Cervoni. 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 All right, so like the macaroni. Good Italian name. Good Italian name. So what have you been doing these days? Well, uh, I actually just finished wrapping a World War II film. Uh, we believe it's going to come out toward the end of the year, Christmas to New Year's. It's uh, one of the untold uh, true story. Uh, it's a great script. Actually, we're doing something that's never been done. Uh -huh. uh, we're filming it entirely on what's called saturated film. So it's actually going to look just like you were watching real World War II footage. Oh, it's going to really? be that kind of look? brown and grainy. It's amazing. I've seen bits and pieces, and you guys are going to love it at home, I tell you. Any stars that we know about in it? Sure. Uh, uh, Michael Connor Humphreys, who was, right. uh, he played young Forrest Gump. Uh, you could probably remember him with the little braces on his legs and such. Of course. And we also have James Robinson, who's the young William Wallace from Braveheart. Uh, uh, a writer actually called it the Invasions of the Youngins. Wow. Because it's three of the younger guys. Uh, but it's a great film. It took us about two years to film it. Uh, we actually had a, a piece of property that we planted uh, comparable vegetation to Normandy. So when you're there, you it, there's no, it looks like you're in France. I mean, it's amazing. And obviously, we never went to France. But. No, no, no. Liked it, but that's like a big change from doing Goodfellas to this. Yeah, actually, you know, uh, I, I loved every minute of Goodfellas. I thought it was a great opportunity. Yeah. I worked with the biggest guys in the business by far. Yeah. Martin Scorsese, Robert De Niro, Joe Pesci. I mean, yeah. uh, just the caliber of those guys is amazing. And uh, not an ego in the bunch, mind you, too. Now, what about all the guys that made it onto The Sopranos after that? Oh, I love him. Are you kidding? Tony Sirico, Paulie Walnuts? I love Paulie Walnuts. And Michael Imperioli, man, I, I, I absolutely love him. I think he's great. I love his Patron commercials. Oops. Do you still keep in touch with him? Uh, I, haven't, I haven't, unfortunately, I haven't uh, kept in touch with Michael that much. He's, you know, one of the busiest guys out there. Yeah. I do keep in touch with some of the guys, Don Conti, Ron Marconi. Mm -hmm. uh, I, I've been to Danero's restaurant here and there. Uh, I called Marty. I'm still waiting. Call me back. That's it. You got to give this kid something. Uh, but yeah, uh, I'm sure uh, after the after Pathfinders comes out, I'm hoping it is a real big catalyst and it'll just bring me right back to him. No, exactly. I mean, you got to be uh, versatile and Absolutely. change uh, uh, roles. Uh, uh, a good actor has a little bit of range, and uh, I think it's great that I could do, I could start off with something like this and then do something completely different. And yeah, this is a great foundation. Absolutely. And it'll Absolutely. be it, this film will last forever. Absolutely. I hope it does. I don't see it going anywhere, you know. Uh, even to this day, I get people on the street that come up and say, "Hey, Hendry, hey, Hendry," and I'm, I, you know, I, I can't get enough of it. Uh, Goodfellas has some of the best fans in the world, I think. Yes. Some of the most down-to-earth, real people you'll ever meet, and they're gen and they're genuine film fans. And if you're a film fan, you have to admire Goodfellas. Martin Scorsese is an absolute genius. Uh, I, you know, I, I can only pray I'm fortunate enough to work with him again. If you're listening. You know, uh, they just had the 20th or the 25th anniversary of Goodfellas. In the, there was the 20th in yeah. the city. Yeah. Uh, unfortunately, I was filming, so I couldn't get away. But I would have loved to have made it. There's another reunion coming up uh, in November, uh, and I hope I can make it to that one. I don't see why not. I may. I'll. I'll make it happen if need be. You living out here, and you're in LA. Uh, I actually don't live in LA. I live out west. I. Uh, I just actually relocated to Portland, Oregon. Right. That's where the film was filmed out in Oregon. Uh, but like most New Yorkers, we may go away for a moment, but we always come back. That's and, it. Uh, forget about it. Forget about it. But well, Chris, listen, it was a pleasure meeting you. Johnny, it was a pleasure meeting you, buddy. And I will definitely see you in the future sometime. I hope so. It's a date. Definitely. Be Thank good. You, Johnny.